Yeah. Oh no, I didn't. <laughs> How long has our flight been delayed? Like two hours. Oh my god. Yeah, we're about to board. Finally. Yeah, I don't want to record the line. Thank you so much for waiting on this gentlemen. At this time, if you have any free board passengers, free board passengers, welcome aboard. What's that? Some people say I'm a camera whore. Up there? I think other one. Yeah. Oh my god. You're insane. This is gonna be the greatest video you ever made. <laughs> Jess and I just landed. We're at baggage claim. She's right there. <laughs> oh god. So this is the fourth, no, the third time I travel with Jess. Yeah, just Jess, because usually we're always traveling to Katie, and Katie's coming on this trip too. We're actually in Denver, Colorado. I don't even think I mentioned that, but yeah. We're in Denver, Colorado, and we're in Katie was flying from San Francisco and Jessica and I were flying from LAX. <laughs> I was like, where the fuck are we flying? Anyway, we're at Katie's baggage claim. She said, I mean, I'm pretty sure she landed already. Or she's at the gate, because that's what the goddamn sign says. <laughs> right there. Anyway, our flight was tight. We got two free drinks. I'm pretty, I'm not like super buzzed, but like my eyes are like, like we're feeling good. We're we feeling good. To say, like, for sure. Oh, we should be closer to Yeah, we're feeling good. How do you pretend she's my girlfriend? But it's not like. But really, we always do that. Yeah. Though. Like we always pretend. For like the past four and a half years. Yeah. So basically, like <laughs> the. the the plane was kind of packed, actually. It was, full. it was pretty full, and Jess was B and I was C, so she went in first, and she was like at the end of C, and I was like in the middle. I mean, she was at the end of B, and I was like in the middle of C. Anyway, she saved a C for me, and she ended up having to tell the guy that I was her girlfriend. So he like literally picked me out of the group of people that were still trying to get like to the back. Cause she had texted me, so I was like, all right, I'm not letting anyone tell me that I gotta go to the front. Yeah. And this guy picks me out out of his group and he's like, alright, everyone's gonna go to the back except for her, because I know her. I was like, who are you? <laughs> like, what? Anyway, he grabs my bag, or like my carry-on bag, he grabs my board, and he puts it away. And I just sit next to Jess and we're girlfriends. We're girlfriends, we're dating. <laughs> I don't know if he convinces. I mean, if he was convinced, do you think he was? No, that's a good question. I don't think he was convinced, I but I don't think minute. he minded. Yeah, I think for a minute and he was convinced. Yeah, and he ended up giving us drinks. Because Jessica just turned 21 like a month ago. So I'm pretty sure that's why he gave it to us. Yeah, because I was like, oh, it's my birthday. Oh, you said it? Yeah, I was oh, like, I need okay. a birthday shot. Oh, okay. Birthday True. Yeah, because he ended up saying like, happy birthday or whatever. But my birthday was like forever ago. <laughs> so clearly it was Jessica's birthday. Anyway, that flight was tight and we're just waiting for Katie. Waiting for Katie. Tell her that she has to get on the train and wait till like the last stop. Okay, okay. <laughs> She's texted saying, y'all, I'm so ducking confused. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, the Denver airport is kind of confusing. Yeah. Cause there's like a lot of levels to it and the last level is for baggage claim. But yeah, we basically just follow people from our plane. Basically, we're in Denver on like a vacation. We're here for four days and we're gonna see Al J on Monday. So that's basically how we came over here. We're gonna, honestly, I haven't even heard Al J's new album, but just logging in. It's at the Red Rock Amphitheater. I can't say that word. It's there. So yeah, I can't wait to see that. Yes. I'm so excited for these next few days and my arm is hurting so bad so I'm leaving. <laughs>
It's morning time. We're getting ready. Before we gotta check out of the hotel and leave the train. I mean, leave to the train. <laughs> yeah, and this is where our vacation starts. We left our hotel. And now we're in the train. We're heading to Union Station and then we're gonna head to Eat. And then we're gonna go to our Airbnb, find and leave. This is it. So cute. Look, this is activities to do when you're stunned as fuck. Under 21. We made it to Denver and we're eating at. Right there. And we're across the street from now. Oh, Jessica and I got a margarita. I'm trying her horchata. Yeah, Katie got an horchata because she's 12. <laughs> Just kidding, she's 20. Wasn't well, I blessed in? It's this. pretty good. <laughs> this is so cute. Oh, it's freezing. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh my god, that is like so... Cool. I'm getting one to go. This, I don't even mind more chocolate. No, this is oh. like This is also good. You never, I could just be like, oh, I didn't want it. You saw that it's going down there. How do you zoom in? Oh, I'm sorry, I want to go. Oh, yeah. It's really, really good. Yeah, I thought he was seeing you too. Okay, I don't know if you want to like... Huh? It's so good. He doesn't want to stay behind the line. He gets to the back of it. He gets really high from the back of it. He gets to the back of it. Oh, she's a puppy. Honestly, she thinks she's a puppy. I'm going to get back from the back of it. What did you get? What were you got? Oh, I got shredded beef. Oh, the top. I love it. He recommend Eddie recommended it, so I'm very excited. What did you get? I got <laughs> chicken mole enchilada. That's what they look like. If you've never tried mole, you have to. It's a really weird taste that I don't really like, but a lot of people do. Huh? A little bit of chocolate. Yeah. And I got a steak quesadilla that I'm super excited about. Yeah. We just finished having lunch and we're just realizing how thankful and grateful and blessed we are. Don't they have a question? It's a fact. There. We know these things. Okay. Do you have anything you have to say? Uh, I'm super happy right now. We met the owner of the restaurant that we ate at and he gave us the meal for free. So that was, you know, he didn't have to do that. He did that out of the kindness of his heart. So that was really unexpected and really great of him to do that. So. And that was the restaurant we just ate at. Like I just showed the sign of it. 
appreciating it. Yeah, everything was completely free. It All we paid so was for a tip, and the owner was amazing. What do you think? Um, so we met Eddie, he was the owner, and he was so nice. He um, he really encouraged all of us to follow our dreams. Yeah. And and move to Denver? Yeah, to Denver. in Denver, like this is a great city, and we've been here for an hour, two hours Yeah, like two. Um, it's been great, we took a picture with him. Hold on, it's not focusing. It's not gonna focus, put it a little right there. Yeah, that's our photo. Oh, it, oh sorry. <laughs> y at de Corazones in, in Denver. Off of, off of Blake, Blake Street and Union 16. Blake, Blake, Blake and 16. 16. Go eat at de Corazones. Yeah. The food was amazing. I should, yeah, we'll see you later. Where are we going? Staying in Littleton for four days until Tuesday. And then, yeah, we don't really know what we're gonna do. The plan is, is it getting my head? Okay. The plan is the Rocky Mountains. That's what it's called. The Rocky Mountains. A hot spring. Then might as well go to boat. Yeah. Where are we? We are at the Denver Biscuit Company. <laughs> <laughs> what did you get, Katie? Oh, the same thing. Um, we all got the Franklin. But I got Franklin. Yeah. So this is a Franklin. <laughs> All right, we're gonna eat now. Are you still eating? You devoured that compared to me. I left like a ton of stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> She also got a turkey soup. That's what it was called. It was super good. That was super good. What is this place called? Busteria um, Marco. Yeah, so it's an Italian restaurant. I got a steak salad. So excited to eat. What did you think of your food, Katie? Yeah, I thought it was like changing. Oh my god. How was yours? 
Mine was delicious. <laughs> House salad with pine nuts. I love pine nuts. Uh, she said that 10 times. Because uh, they're delicious and really expensive. Uh, but it was really good. And then I had a lamb panini. Oh my god. Wow. And the potato salad? Oh yeah, the potato salad is alright. I'm picky, so, you know. It's hard to please me with potato salad. <laughs> All right. Thank, okay. you. Thank you. My dinner was amazing. I got bread and a steak salad. The steak salad was delicious. Honestly, could just park here. Can we?
see what we can see. Mm -hmm. This is the sweater she's thinking of buying. It's out of the seagull set. Twenty two. So they're festival seagulls. Yeah. This the cheapest one we found. Yeah. Yeah. They just take one of those hours. And we bought pins and patches that we're gonna be. Oh really? And Katie's lost. Yeah, we can't find Katie. It's in the front. The sweater's not bad on the long sleeve shirts are. <laughs> oh. Katie's gonna try it on. It's like the same that the same material that's in that is in this. Ooh. So Ooh. We're trying on sweaters. We try on the small now on top of that sweater. Let's just see how it's gonna fit now. Keep getting dressed, woman. Oh my god, look at her hair. Look at this dirty ass mirror. We're gonna be like, all right, we don't want to go up anymore. Let's go. No, we have to. We have to be at the highest point. I think point. there's enough room in the sleeves to where like it's not uncomfortable. How do you feel, Katie? Um, it's super comfy. <laughs> Are you gonna purchase it? I'm not sure. It is cheap though. Twenty-two dollars for a sweater compared to like fifty. But the thing is, it's going to look really fast. So it probably won't work. The thing is, <laughs> bitch, wear. Yeah, bitch, wear. <laughs> um, never mind. I was gonna do a PSA. You already started. PSA at visitor center. The proceeds go back to the park, but at this place, it doesn't. Really? Why? Because it's not a visitor center. Oh. Somebody owns us. Well, at least we brought something from the visitor center. Okay, end of recording. This is what we're walking up right now. Oh, I don't know what this is called. What is it called? A hill? Oh, here we are. Starting. How do you guys feel? How do you feel? I'm tired. The oh, air is very thin. You think so? Super thin. I'm dying, you think so? <laughs> Alright, we're halfway there. And we're out of breath. Stop. 
Denver Airport Station, our final destination. All passengers, please exit the train and make sure you have all your personal belongings. 